Danxiu, Qixiu, Tixiu, Jianxiu. This is a vast world of cultivation with a variety of cultivation systems. Tags. Planting and flowing, alchemy, easy, funny, and cautious. Keywords of the novel. Danxiu Dao without pop-ups, download the complete collection of Danxiu Dao TXT, and read the latest chapters of Danxiu Dao. Chapter 1. Pure Crossing or Infinite Flow. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 1. Pure Crossing or Infinite Flow, What Kind of Thing? Lu Ming opened his eyes wide and found himself lying on the gravel ground, with the sound of flowing water coming from his ear. Where is this? I was just in front of the grave before Lu Ming could quickly sort out his thoughts, a strange memory surged into his mind. He has traveled. The original owner of this body was named Yi Bufan, the illegitimate son of the head of the Yi family in the cultivation family. Today, he was chased by someone sent by his father's legitimate wife. In a desperate situation, Yi Bufan chose to jump off the cliff, fighting for a glimmer of life, and then died. Even if it's time to travel, there's no need to be so miserable. Lu Ming, who had strong adaptability, immediately stood up. Strange memories told him that he was still in danger, and the top priority was to escape the danger first. He saw a blood stain on the ground, which was blood flowing from his head. Now the wound on his head has disappeared. All bodily functions are normal, Lu Ming shook his whole body. I must leave here quickly, wait. Lu Ming looked up at the top of the cliff, but no one came down. It seems that the person who killed him has already arrived here along the way down. I can't just escape like this. Lu Ming looked at the blood and gravel and quickly thought he was just a small cultivator in the first layer of qi refining. He killed three people, one in the third layer and two in the second layer. He left in a panic and was easily caught up with. Now, he needs to create some misleading information. After having an idea, Lu Ming quickly acted and after finishing everything, he entered the forest ahead without leaving a trace. About half a quarter of an hour. Three young men of varying heights arrived at the foot of the cliff. Yi Bufan's life is really great. He wouldn't even die if he jumped down so high. Not dying is also a serious injury. With his current state, he can't run far. There are only two directions to leave here, let's chase each other separately. There's no need for such trouble, you two look at the bloodstains on the ground and the scattered stones. Yi Bufan must have escaped along the direction of the river's flow. Big brother, you're still smart. Of course, let's chase after it. The three of them ran down the small river at the fastest speed. They all hoped to find Yi Bufan in the shortest possible time and then kill him. After a quarter of an hour, the three of them returned here, and the older brother among them had a gloomy expression. We were all deceived by him. No, big brother, that's all you analyzed. You shut up. Yi Bufan must have left the forest, and with his injuries, he can't go far. We still have time to catch up now. At the moment the three of them entered the forest, they discovered three footprints. Yi Bufan, how could he become so cunning? The cultivator on the third level of qi refining looked even worse. Big brother, what should we do now? Of course, it's a split operation. The two of you are responsible for searching this forest, don't miss every place. I'm responsible for chasing from this direction. Yes, big brother. At a fork in the road, a young man appeared with many bloodstains on his body. Lucky they didn't catch up. Lu Ming turned around and breathed a sigh of relief in his heart. By now, he had basically escaped danger, but he had not completely escaped it yet. Choosing a path far away from the influence of the Yi family, Lu Ming began to run with all his might. As the sky gradually darkened, Lu Ming saw no one around and immediately plunged into a small mountain. Running all the way, he met many ordinary people who secretly looked at him as he was running, and then lowered their heads to continue on their journey. Lu Ming was afraid of these ordinary people and was forced by his pursuers to ask him his way, 
so he chose to enter the roadside hill at this time. This small mountain has dense forests and is a good place to avoid pursuit. I'm exhausted. Stopping, Lu Ming leaned against the big tree, panting heavily, his spiritual energy depleted in the sea of qi, and his physical strength also depleted. Life is full of surprises, and what only happens in novels like Time Travel actually happens to me. During the rest, while sorting out unfamiliar memories, Lu Ming also attempted to understand the current situation. He, Lu Ming, comes from a blue planet and doesn't know who his biological parents are. He was adopted by an elderly couple, who are his adoptive parents. His foster father passed away when he was 18 years old, and his foster mother left last year. Yesterday, due to the impact of the market, the company had economic problems and needed to lay off employees. Unfortunately, he, who likes to work alone, became one of them. Today, it was the day of his foster mother's sacrifice. While worshipping his foster mother at the grave, he suddenly saw a white pearl emitting light floating in mid-air. Just as he realized it, he let out a loud scream, and the pearl burrowed into his body. When he opened his eyes, he had already arrived in this world. By the way, Pearl. It must have been this thing that caused me to travel, and the things that caused me to travel are usually the necessary golden fingers for travelers. Lu Ming quickly checked his body, and after becoming a cultivator, he could look inside his body. In the sea of qi in his body, Lu Ming discovered the pearl, which was emitting a white light at this moment, illuminating his sea of qi. This is the bead. After crossing over to this body, all injuries have recovered, and it is highly likely that this bead is also the cause. Lu Ming leaned against the tree for a long time, finally absorbing all the unfamiliar memories and organizing them very clearly. This world is somewhat similar to the cultivation world described in many novels, which makes Lu Ming doubt whether he is considered a time traveler. Perhaps one may be the chosen god in the so dot called Main Divine Space, and then travel through various novels and movie worlds to complete missions, rather than just pure travel. Sure enough, I've read a lot of things and have all sorts of inexplicable ideas. Lu Ming has been reading online novels for five or six years, and has read quite a few novels. Now I should figure out what the white beads in my sea of qi are really for. If this bead shows me any mission information, then my second guess is correct. If it's a treasure, then I'm just a simple time traveler. Lu Ming tried to take a deep breath. So the question is, how do we activate this bead? His first idea is that this bead is in the sea of qi, and it is likely to be activated by injecting spiritual power. Thinking of this, Lu Ming didn't say a word and began to meditate to restore his spiritual power. Once in a cycle, a trace of spiritual power appeared in Xiao Zhoutian's sea of energy. Lu Ming stopped practicing and injected a trace of spiritual power from the sea of qi into the beads. The next moment, Lu Ming disappeared in place, a seemingly ordinary white bead falling onto the withered leaves on the ground and rolling twice. End of this chapter Chapter 2 I understand this situation. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 2 I understand this situation at the moment when a trace of spiritual power was injected into the white pearl, Lu Ming felt his head sink and his eyes turn black. When he opened his eyes again, the scenery in front of him completely changed. There is a dark patch of land in front of him, emitting a very thin spiritual energy. This is Ling Tian. Lu Ming's eyes lit up and he nodded. I understand, I understand. This is not just pure time travel, then farming to get rich, and finally taking drugs to become immortal with boundless magical power. Lu Ming glanced around and found that besides the Ling Tian, there was also a black cauldron. He gave a faint glance at the cauldron and then coughed. Don't hide, I know you're right there, come out quickly. After a long time, the surroundings remained quiet and no one replied to his words. Lu Ming touched his chin. That's not right. Normally, this type of spatial treasure with a spiritual field is likely to have an artifact spirit, and its function is to accelerate the growth of the planted spiritual medicine. 
Just now, he tried to summon the spirit from the white bead, but there was no response from him. There are usually only two possibilities for this situation to occur. One is that the spirit of the artifact has fallen asleep, and the other is that there is no spirit of the artifact inside the white bead. Without the expected appearance of the artifact spirit, Lu Ming came to the side of the black cauldron. At a close glance, the black cauldron was not only black but also black, and the magical thing was that the center of the black cauldron seemed to be bottomless. Lu explicitly touched the black cauldron, and in an instant, a transparent light screen appeared on the cauldron. Damn it! High tech branches! At the moment of seeing the screen, Lu Ming seriously suspected that this white bead was a high dot tech product. There are four options on the transparent screen information, upgrade, acceleration, and leave. Let Lu Ming think that the white beads are an important reason for high dot tech products, which is the symbol in the upper right corner. This is really too familiar. Without further ado, Lu Ming lightly clicked on information first. The transparent light screen changes, presenting simple information about the spatial spiritual field. Name Lingtian Grade None Area One Acre Bonus None a spiritual field with thin spiritual energy and no grade is called a quasi-spiritual field, and there are very few spiritual medicines that can be planted. Cross out the secondary page and proceed with the sequence. Lu Ming clicked on Upgrade. There are three conditions for Ling Tian to upgrade. Condition 1. 100 lower grade spirit stones, incomplete, condition 2. Achieve the first level of refining gas cultivation, completed, condition 3. Planting one acre of inferior Ling Mean harvesting, unfinished, the more it looks, the more it looks like high dot tech, and it doesn't seem like a treasure of time in the world of cultivation at all. Lu Ming has 10% certainty that there is absolutely no artifact spirit in the space of this white bead. If there is, it is not called instrumental intelligence, but artificial intelligence. Among the three conditions, the first upgrade condition is to have 100 lower grade spirit stones, and Lu Ming looked at the bottomless black ding center. The spirit stone must have been stuffed into this. This black cauldron is really not big, only up to his navel and eye. Out of curiosity, Lu Ming put his hand inside to explore, but not only could he not touch it to the bottom, but all four sides were empty, and he couldn't even touch the edge. If I jump in, will it just disappear? Curiosity returns to curiosity. This kind of attempt is something that Lu Ming wouldn't do. In case the person is gone, he becomes one of the fast dying travelers, still dying inside the golden finger. Close the transparent page of Upgrade and click on the Acceleration page. Lu Ming has an impulse to curse. A lower grade spirit stone accelerates five times for three days while four lower-grade spirit stones accelerate ten times for three days. Too much. Isn't acceleration supposed to be a built-that-in effect of space? Why consume spirit stones? Obviously, no one can give Lu Ming an answer. Upgrading something requires multiple conditions to be met in order to upgrade, which Lu Ming can understand. After all, after upgrading, you can always be satisfied. But this acceleration requires the consumption of spirit stones, and Lu Ming cannot understand because he is not satisfied. This is a disguised weakening of his golden fingers. It's okay to be chaste at the beginning. This acceleration requires the consumption of spirit stones, which is dragging down my development. Just now, he thought that the second level page of acceleration was just for his master to adjust the acceleration multiplier at will but the result was that there was a fee for acceleration. Lu Ming took a deep breath and realized that adults need to learn self-regulation. Therefore, he thought that in some novels, there are as many tragic protagonists as there are tragic ones, as well as some novels that start with an avalanche. Quickly, his mood improved a lot. Upon careful consideration, apart from a malicious woman trying to kill him, making him uneasy, 
and the need to consume spirit stones to accelerate, all other aspects are still good. For example, his cultivation talent includes the main spiritual root being fire, which is one foot long, and the auxiliary spiritual root being wood and soil, one three inch three and one four inch one. Although this talent may not be considered good, it is definitely not bad either. If he is really useless, that malicious wife wouldn't send someone to kill him. In addition to his good talent, he also has a low dot level storage bag on his body, which contains 18 inferior spirit stones, two bottles of Pigu Dan, the cultivation technique, fire control technique, the low dot level spell, fireball technique, and some miscellaneous items such as clothing. At the beginning of the game, having 18 inferior spirit stones in hand is much better than not having a single inferior spirit stone. Now is not the time to stay in the bead for a long time. After balancing his mind, Lu Ming planned to leave the space inside the white bead first. Now he doesn't know whether the white beads disappear into the air or just outside after he enters them. If it falls outside, is there no fluctuation of spiritual energy around the white bead, or is there a fluctuation of spiritual energy? Lu Ming doesn't even know about these. With a light click on, leave, Lu Ming felt a darkness in front of him again. When he opened his eyes, he returned to the forest. At the first moment when he returned to the outside, Lu Ming sensed and saw if the white beads were still in the Sea of Qi. Unfortunately, I cannot know if the bead will disappear directly after I enter it. If it does, then this is a peerless treasure that can escape all pursuits. Lu Ming shook his head lightly and set aside his thoughts. He was only temporarily safe, not completely out of danger yet. He took a new piece of clothing from the low dot level storage bag and replaced the bloodstained clothes. The bloodstains on the back of his head were not treated as there was no water source nearby. The urgent task now is to restore spiritual power, Lu Mingpan sat down. Wait until evening, and then take advantage of the darkness to leave. Sensing the spiritual energy of heaven and earth, opening up the Sea of Qi, and giving birth to a trace of spiritual power in the Sea of Qi, is the way to refine a layer of Qi. When the spiritual power in the Sea of Qi breaks through a hundred threads, it becomes the second layer of Qi refining. Lu Ming's current Sea of Qi can hold up to 80 strands of spiritual power. If we insist on subdividing it, it can be considered as the later stage of refining Qi. End of this chapter. Chapter 3 Huangsha County. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 3 Huangsha County The night shrouded the earth, with twinkling stars in the night sky. At the exit at the edge of the forest, the trio chasing Lu Ming converged at this point in time. Big brother, we explored every part of the forest and didn't see any trace of Yi Bufan. He must have escaped. Yes, he has already escaped. The third level elder brother in charge of refining Qi, who was chasing out of the forest, nodded. His face looked pretty good. I asked the pedestrians on the road, and they saw Yi Bufan with blood on his body. The two younger brothers on the second level of gas refining looked at each other with puzzled eyes upon hearing this. Isn't Yi Bufan injured? Big brother. At your speed, there's no problem catching up with him. If he was really injured and it affected his speed, I wouldn't let him escape, said the elder brother of the third layer of Qi refining, shaking his head lightly. Although he was injured, it didn't affect his speed at all. I have asked him clearly about his escape speed, and according to the passers-by's description, there is no difference between him and a cultivator with a level of Qi refining. After becoming a cultivator, even if one has not practiced any spells that can accelerate speed, injecting spiritual power from the sea of qi into their feet can make them run much faster than ordinary people. As both cultivators, the speed difference between the first layer of qi refining and the third layer of qi refining is not particularly significant. Under normal circumstances, the speed at which the third layer of gas refining can run at full force is at most 20% faster than the first layer of gas refining. The time wasted falling off the cliff, combined with the time wasted due to initial misjudgment, 
is destined to catch up with Lu Ming, the elder brother of the third level of gas refining. Big brother, what do you think we should do now? Yes, big brother. Yi Bufan has run away, and you understand Madam's temper. We haven't completed the task she assigned us, so there won't be any good fruit to eat when we go back. Don't worry, I've already figured out a reason. On the way back, the elder brother from the third level of Qi refining thought about many reasons to defend them, and he chose the best one. Yi Bufan jumped off such a high cliff, injured and bleeding, and it didn't affect his movement speed at all. This indicates that the master must have given this illegitimate son a top dot quality life dot saving pill. With the life dot saving pill, our failure is also normal. Wow. Big brother, you're so smart. In this way, madam will definitely throw her anger at the head of the family. Who knows the head's attitude towards his illegitimate child. Hee <laughs> hee. My intelligence is also evident to all of you. The elder brother of the third layer of Qi refining showed a smile, and the two younger brothers immediately thought of the elder brother's judgment mistake before, which was the root cause of the mission failure. They wisely did not mention it. I want to give this reason a perfect score because it is a fact and there are no flaws to be found. Big brother, do you know in which direction Yi Bufan ran? Of course I know, I waited at the fork in the road for a while before I found out. Ordinary people will explain what they know clearly when facing the problems of cultivators, otherwise they will be the ones who get angry and unlucky. Yi Bufan took the road to the east. Oh, he actually chose to leave the Yi family. I thought he would go find the head of the family. To the east lies the influence range of the Shuzhen aristocratic family, the Lan family, and beyond that lies the influence range of the Madam's family, the Zhang family. If Yi Bufan chooses to go to the east, either his head is knocked out of his wits, or he doesn't even know that the Zhang family is there. We just need to tell Madam this news, and there may not even be the last point of punishment. I finally understand why when Big Brother came back, he looked in a good mood. It turns out our retreat was already so perfect. It's good if you two know. Alright, stop talking. Let's go back and explain Yi Bufan's situation to Madam. The three left with a good mood. Although Yi Bufan was lucky enough to escape their pursuit, he would eventually die at the hands of his wife. Midnight. Lu Ming opened his eyes and stopped restoring his spiritual power. Here, the spiritual energy of heaven and earth is thin, and the speed of Xiao Zhou Tian's movement is very slow, resulting in a slow recovery of spiritual power. After three hours, he only recovered sixty strands of spiritual power. This world of cultivation lasts for twelve hours a day, and each hour is divided into eight and a quarter minutes. A month has thirty days, without distinction between big and small months. Twelve months and one year have three hundred and sixty days. At present, Lu Ming probably knows that it is midnight, between eleven p.m. and one a.m. At this moment, ordinary people were already asleep, and Lu Ming wanted to take advantage of this time to rush on his way. Everything is good now, but there is no map that I most want. This really made Lu Ming uncomfortable. In Yi Bufan's memory, there is very little information about the area outside the influence of the Yi family's influence. For example, in this place now, he only knows that it is not within the influence of the Yi family's influence, but it is not clear where it is. The most important thing now is to find a county town and buy what I want. He, who has no spiritual medicine seeds on him, is still unable to start his farming career. In typical county towns, there are workshops where cultivators specialize in trading, which are controlled by the cultivator families in the county town. The characteristic of a county without a cultivator's workshop city is its small area and the absence of a miniature spiritual vein. A place without spiritual veins is like the small mountain where Lu Ming is currently staying, where the spiritual energy of heaven and earth is so thin that even the lowest level monsters are unwilling to stay. Lu Ming left the small mountain, and without a map and no passers by asking for directions, he could only run along this main road. A small path usually leads to a village and a small town, 
and the probability of having a monk's workshop is particularly low in such small places. After consuming five strands of spiritual power and running wildly for half an hour, Lu Ming finally saw a river, and the bloodstains on the back of his head could finally be cleared properly. Comfortable. After washing his head fiercely and steaming his hair dry with a hint of spiritual power, Lu Ming suddenly felt refreshed and refreshed. He is a man who loves cleanliness very much. Returning to the main road, he entered a frenzy mode again. One night passed, the sky was hazy, and he finally saw the county town. Huangsha County Lu Ming looked at the three big characters on the city gate and his mood improved a lot. Entering the county town requires paying entry fees to soldiers, which is for ordinary people. If you are a cultivator, you do not need to pay entry fees. Lu Ming entered the county town and headed towards the cultivator's workshop, without any intention of pretending to be an ordinary person. He simply proved his identity to the soldiers. Where is Fangshir? Lu Ming asked the soldier. Southwest region, the soldier replied. As he approached Huangsha County, Lu Ming had already felt a slight increase in the spiritual energy of heaven and earth, which depended on his one foot long main spiritual route. If the main spiritual route was shorter than one foot, it was impossible to have such a keen perception. In a county town, the place where the spiritual energy of heaven and earth is most abundant is the location of the local cultivator family, followed by the cultivator market, both of which have large and simple spiritual gathering arrays. A one-month new book period, urgently needed tickets. Also, before signing the contract, the author usually only has one change per day. End of this chapter Chapter 4 Market and Residence You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 4 Market and Residence There is a miniature spiritual vein in Huangsha County, located at the junction of the Huang family mansion of the Little Shuzhen family and the Xiaoshifang city, with the larger spiritual vein located below the Huang family mansion. The cultivators in the county town are generally managed by local cultivators. There are people guarding the entrance of the cultivator's workshop, who are senior guards of the Huang family. The guard looked at Lu Ming and attempted to stop him. When Lu Ming extended his right hand and a hint of spiritual power appeared in his hand, the two strong guards of the Huang family withdrew their gaze from Lu Ming's body. As long as you are a cultivator, entering the cultivator market is very smooth. Just as he stepped into the neighborhood market, Lu Ming could feel that the concentration of heaven and earth spiritual energy here was really much higher than outside. To restore spiritual power here, he only needs an hour and a half to fully restore all 80 strands of spiritual power. In the early morning cultivator market, there were no street stalls as Lu Ming had imagined, and all the shops were open. Lu Ming, who had a clear purpose, quickly found a shop selling various books on cultivation, and after a brief stroll, he found the book he wanted, Basic Planting. The introduction tells Lu Ming that this is a book that briefly discusses the cultivation of spiritual objects. The book also includes the cultivation methods of three spiritual crops. Inferior spiritual rice, clover, and yellow sesame. I want this. Lu Ming picked up basic planting and placed it in front of the counter owner, with no excessive expression on his face. The expressionless face was not deliberately put on by Lu Ming. In daily life, he likes to use this face to face colleagues and strangers. That's why he doesn't have many friends, which also leads to his personality of being solitary. Five Inferior Spirit Stones The boss quoted with a smile on his face. Lu Ming's face was very unfamiliar, and he didn't look like an easy duck going cultivator. As an ordinary person's boss, he quoted a reasonable price. Hmm. Take out five inferior spiritual stones, put away, basic planting, and Lu Ming immediately leaves. He didn't know that his facial paralysis prevented him from being taken advantage of by the middle dot aged boss. In Yi Bufan's memory, the prices of various cultivation books were blank, so Lu Ming Zhen did not know whether it was reasonable to purchase basic planting with five inferior spiritual stones. Anyway, 
his instinctive reaction is that it's too expensive. Lu Ming is very clear about the concept of five lower-grade spiritual stones. A lower-grade spirit stone can purchase ten pigu pills, and taking one pigu pill can prevent cultivators from eating or drinking for three days. After becoming a monk, he is different from ordinary people in terms of food. Ordinary people eat ordinary food without any spiritual energy. After a cultivator eats it, they need to spend a lot of time eliminating internal impurities every day, otherwise they cannot practice. If a cultivator wants to improve their cultivation, they must not eat ordinary food. The minimum monthly consumption is 10 pigu pills. Five lower grade spirit stones are the most ordinary cultivators, with five months of food expenses. In Lu Ming's opinion, the meal expenses for five months would cost 5,000 yuan no matter what. Buying a vegetable growing book for 5,000 yuan would be a loss of blood no matter how you think. Of course, Lu Ming also knew very well that knowledge in the world of cultivation is terrifyingly expensive. A common cultivation method requires more than 10 inferior spiritual stones. Leaving the first store, Lu Ming quickly arrived at the second store. This store specializes in selling lingmi and pigu dan. Give me four pounds of inferior lingmi, with a shell. Lu Ming placed a piece of inferior lingshir on the counter. Lu Ming doesn't understand the price of books, but he is very clear about the price of inferior lingmi. For inferior lingmi with a shell, one piece of inferior lingshir weighs four pounds, while for inferior lingmi without a shell, one piece of inferior lingshir weighs five pounds. The price of processed lingmi is higher because the shell of lingmi can be used to make talisman paper that carries spiritual power. The process of removing the shell of lingmi is really easy for cultivators, as long as they have spiritual power, they can easily do it. Lu Ming wants inferior lingmi with a shell, so naturally it is used for cultivation. Okay. The boss took the lower grade spirit stone from the table, please wait a moment. After a moment, the boss took out a small bag of inferior lingmi and specially weighed it in front of Lu Ming, which weighed just four pounds. Of course, the boss added the weight of the small bag to the weight of these four pounds. In fact, the weight of the lower grade lingmi is less than four pounds. The seeds of the inferior lingmi are in hand. Next, we need to find a place to live. There are inns in the cultivator market that provide accommodation for cultivators. If cultivators want to use the spiritual energy of the market for cultivation, they must stay in the inns. If you find any place to sit down and start practicing, the local cultivation family will send someone to drive you out of the market. Before being driven out of the neighborhood, I will beat you up first to make you remember. In the city of Xiaoshifang in Huangsha County, there is only one inn that provides accommodation, and the owner of the inn is the local cultivator Huang family. Lu Ming walked into the inn. At the counter, there was a green-clad girl who looked 16 or 17 years old, staring blankly at the opposite wall. There is nothing on the wall. Is she thinking of spring? Upon seeing this situation, Lu Ming habitually had thoughts in his mind and then calmly walked to the counter. Girl, give me a room. Ah. The girl in green was surprised and looked at Lu Ming, who had been staying at the hotel early in the morning. She patted her chest and said straightforwardly, Young master, you scared me. Originally, Lu Ming wanted to burst out with a vulgar remark, but he immediately controlled it. This subconscious oral language really needs to be changed in this world. Sorry, I need a room. Your apology is too insincere, the girl in green said involuntarily as she looked at Lu Ming, who had not too much expression on his face. No city intention means no city intention, but this young master is so handsome after thinking for a moment, the old lady in green continued, forget it, it's not entirely your fault. I shouldn't be in a daze at this moment. Stay for ten days and pay at least one lower grade spirit stone. If you stay a few days less, I will compensate you with the pigu dan. Dot. The cultivation world uses spirit stones as currency, and pigu dan can also serve as currency, but the transaction volume is not large. Mmm. 
Lu Ming took out a piece of inferior spirit stone. The straightforward personality of the girl in green left a good impression on him, which made him feel more at ease when staying in the store. Young master, please follow me. The girl in green is carrying a wooden token with a small amount of spiritual energy, and the number, 37, is written on the token. She brought Lu Ming to the seventh room on the third floor of the inn. The door of the room is not opened by hand, but can only be opened with a token. After the girl in green personally opened the door, she handed the token to Lu Ming's hand. Thank you very much. Young master, as a guest, you are so polite. The girl in green chuckled lightly and left. Yi Bufan was arranged by the head of the Yi family to live in the mountains since he was young, and all he knew was the bishop of the Yi family. In Yi Bufan's memory, Lu Ming did not find any memories of daily etiquette, soil and water culture. Looking at the smile on the girl in green, he thought, being polite is not a bad thing at least, so there's no need to change it. End of this chapter Chapter 5 First Planting You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 5 First Planting The rooms in the inn are very small and the facilities are very rudimentary, with a wooden bed, a long wooden stool, and a wooden table. Apart from these three things, there is nothing else. Closing the door, Lu Ming came to the wall and lightly tapped twice. The sound insulation effect was very good, which satisfied him very much. First, read, basic planting and then enter the space of the beads. Lu Ming made a simple plan and sat on a long wooden stool. He took out his newly purchased, basic planting, from a low dot level storage bag and placed it on a wooden table, then began to flip through it. Unconsciously, an hour passed and Lu Ming closed, basic planting. He had watched it twice, the first time roughly, and the second time carefully. He felt that he had already mastered almost everything. After absorbing knowledge from the book, Lu Ming finally realized that an acre of spiritual field in space cannot be called a spiritual field, it can only be called a quasi-spiritual field. There are only five types of spiritual crops that can be planted in the quasi-spiritual field, namely inferior spiritual rice, black ginseng, small spiritual fruit, yellow sesame, and clover. These five spiritual crops can only barely reach the level of first level lower grade. You can now enter the bead space. Lu Mingpan sat in the wooden bed, closed his eyes, and injected a trace of spiritual power into the white beads. The next moment, he felt a sense of confusion again. Opening his eyes again, he had already arrived at the pearl space, and there was no change in the surrounding scenery. Entering the bead space again, Lu Ming was completely in a different mood. Due to some reasons, he left last time and was too anxious. This time, he needs to observe the bead space carefully and satisfy his curiosity. Firstly, Lu Ming squatted on the ground and touched the dark ground with his hands. Very rough, not much different from cement ground. Standing up, Lu Ming looked around and saw that it was all dark on all sides, as if he couldn't see the edges at all. However, before he took a few steps, he ran into an invisible wall. The area of the space is only one circle larger than this one acre quasi spiritual field. The walls of the space are different from the ground and feel very smooth, similar to a mirror. Lu Ming leaned against the wall of the space and looked up. He didn't understand where the light source in the space came from. It allowed him to see the Ling Tian and Hiding very clearly, while the rest of the space was pitch black. Before returning to Ling Tian, Lu Ming took out a bag of inferior Lingmi with a shell, which was also the seed of inferior Lingmi. Each lower grade Lingmi has a slight difference in weight, with the number of lower grade Lingmi per kilogram ranging from 95 to 105, usually close to 100. Lower grade Lingmi, ripened every three months, is most suitable for planting 300 plants per mu of quasi Ling Tian. One grade lower grade Ling Tian can plant 1000 plants. Lu Ming calculated in his mind that one acre of land is approximately 666 square meters, which means that the best area for a lower grade Lingmi plant is 2.22 square meters. 
the spiritual field in the space is a very standard square. One acre of spiritual field needs to be divided into 300 parts, with each part covering an area of 2.22 square meters. What is the square of the number equal to 2.22? Quickly, Lu Ming entered mental calculation mode. The square of 15 is 225, the square of 14 is 196, and the square of 14.5 is, ah, it's so annoying. Lu Ming grabbed his hair crazily, how many squares are equal to 2.22? What should I do without a computer? Lu Ming, who entered the space with full confidence to farm, was almost driven crazy by the evenly distributed calculation problem. You should know that he once won a special prize in a fifth grade quick calculation competition in elementary school. As a male engineer, Lu Ming is still very strict with himself, especially when it comes to maximizing benefits. Under normal circumstances, the yield of a lower grade Lingmi varies from 10 liang to 20 liang after it matures. One pound is equal to 16 tails. Cultivators who know how to plant will increase the yield of inferior spiritual rice to over 1 kilogram. As one of the factors affecting the production of inferior Lingmi, land area was one of the factors that Lu Ming chose to focus on in order to increase the production of inferior Lingmi. However, he was immediately overwhelmed. Forget it, let me briefly divide it first. Next time, I will carefully divide it and see how much difference can be made in the yield of the lower grade Lingmi. Lu Ming found a reason, stopped his restless calculation, and began to divide the spiritual field. At this moment, Lu Ming suddenly patted his head. I'm so foolish. I don't have any measuring tools. Even if I really calculate the results, I can't accurately divide them. It's better to follow my feelings. Upon arriving at the spiritual field, Lu Ming began using his palm to create dozens of lines horizontally and vertically, roughly dividing the spiritual field into 300 parts. Get it done. Lu Ming patted the soil on his hands and was quite satisfied with his method of dividing his feelings. The segmentation of the spiritual field is completed, and the next step is to plant the seeds of the high dot quality spiritual rice in the center of each small area. According to the book, Basic Planting, it is best to bury the seeds of inferior Lingmi at a depth of about one inch, which is more conducive to the rooting and germination of the seeds. Without a hoe as an agricultural tool, Lu Ming could only do it himself and dig the soil with his hands. Lu Ming just dug an inch deep pit and after some thought, he didn't bury the seeds of the inferior Lingmi. Instead, he continued to dig and worked very hard. He wanted to see what was underneath the Ling Tian that could continuously produce spiritual energy. The spiritual field must be built on top of the spiritual pulse. Without the continuous supply of spiritual energy from the spiritual pulse below, the spiritual field can only become ordinary land in the end. Dig and dig. After digging about a foot deep, Lu Ming found himself unable to dig any further, not because he had bottomed out, but because the soil he had dug would automatically return after reaching a foot deep. This land seems to have its own consciousness. Amazing, my dirt. Lu Ming had no intention of taking it too seriously. Soon, he filled in the excavated soil and left a small hole one inch deep. The size of the inferior Lingmi is much larger than the rice that Lu Ming has seen, and it looks very plump. After a brief glance, Lu Ming planted the first plant of inferior Lingmi, covered it with soil and loosened it to prevent the seedlings of inferior Lingmi from not growing. For the following period of time, he kept repeating his actions, planting one seed after another of inferior Lingmi. When planting to the last small area, Lu Ming planted two inferior Lingmi seeds at once. He wanted to give it a simple try and see what the consequences would be. Basic planting only teaches him how to plant the best without explaining the consequences of not following the methods taught in the book. Perhaps the spiritual fields in the pearl space are different from ordinary spiritual fields, and even if planted together, there will not be any bad results. Lu Ming assumed this possibility. End of this chapter Chapter 6 Cycle and Cultivation 
You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 6 Cycle and Cultivation Farming is not only a physical task, but also a technical one. Lu Ming, who repeatedly bent down, straightened his body and moved his muscles and bones. In fact, he was not very tired, but if it were for the body of the previous social animal, by now, it was likely that his back and waist were sore. The cultivator has no acquired impurities in his body, and his physique is much better than that of ordinary people. Before becoming a cultivator, the more one meditates, the more painful it becomes. After becoming a cultivator, this kind of pain will no longer exist. 301 lower grade Lingmi plants, calculated based on 300 plants, each plant can produce 1 pound of lower grade Lingmi. Then there are 300 pounds of lower grade Lingmi plants. 4 pounds of inferior Lingmi, one piece of inferior lingshir, and 300 pounds of inferior lingmi can sell for 70.5 yuan of inferior lingshir. Lu Ming calculated based on the price of his own stall. If he sold inferior lingmi to the shop owner, there was not such a high price. After planting is completed, the next step is to accelerate the growth of the lower grade lingmi in the beet space. Lu Ming approached the black cauldron and touched it, and a transparent light screen appeared in front of him. There are two options for acceleration. Lu Ming clicked on the cheaper gear and used a lower grade spirit stone to accelerate five times, lasting for three days. Lower grade Lingmi takes 90 days to mature, accelerates growth five times, and only takes 18 days to mature. Lu Ming calculated in his heart and took out six inferior spirit stones, throwing them into the black cauldron, allowing the acceleration time to last for 18 days. When the six inferior spirit stones are swallowed by the black cauldron, a three-dot-level page pops up on the transparent light screen, displaying a countdown of 18 days. On either side of the number 18 days, there is a start button and a pause button. Lu Ming clicked the start button and said, this design is great, it can temporarily stop the acceleration of crop growth at any time. After finishing everything, Lu Ming finally glanced at Ling Tian and clicked on the small box to leave. After planting inferior Lingmi, it is necessary to take good care of the specific growth period to increase the yield of inferior Lingmi. Lu Ming doesn't know if the spiritual field in the white beads is different from other spiritual fields. All of this will have to wait until the seedlings of the inferior spiritual rice grow out. Between four to six days after planting inferior Lingmi seeds, the seedlings will emerge from the soil, and the bead space only takes about a day for the seedlings to grow. Lu Ming decided to enter the bead space at the same time tomorrow to see the growth of the lower grade Lingmi. I'm really lucky. At the beginning, I wasn't completely penniless, otherwise I wouldn't even be able to afford to plant the first batch of inferior Lingmi. After returning to the inn room, Lu Ming looked at his low dot level storage bag for the first time. Originally, 18 pieces of inferior spiritual stones were used. Five pieces were used to purchase basic planting, one piece was used to purchase inferior spiritual rice, and an additional six pieces were used for acceleration. By the way, one piece was also used for staying at the store. A total of 13 inferior spirit stones were consumed and now he only has five inferior spirit stones left in his hand. Gulu Gulu Lu Ming's stomach emitted a hungry cry. Calculate the time, it has been three days since the last time I took the Pigu pill. There are two bottles of Pigu Dan in the low dot level storage bag. One bottle contains ten pills, while the other bottle is not filled with only seven pills. Lu Ming took out a small porcelain bottle containing a small amount of Pigu Dan, poured out a Pigu Dan, and observed it briefly. The color of Pigu Dan is light yellow, with a volume slightly larger than a glass ball and a weight of about one or two. It doesn't smell at all. Very light sweetness. Lu Ming took a sip of Pigu Dan, and after feeling its taste, his taste bud swallowed it. The Pai Gu Dan only works when swallowed, not like sugar. As long as it is slowly reduced in the mouth, it will have an effect. The memory passed from Yi Bufan to Lu Ming is like a movie from a first-person perspective. 
During the process of absorbing memories, Lu Ming couldn't experience the taste of what Yi Bufan had eaten. Similarly, Yi Bufan's feelings and feelings were not something he could experience. All he could feel was sound and visuals, and thoughts were even less likely to be received in his mind. I felt it so quickly. Lu Ming touched the position of his stomach, without the imagined feeling of fullness, only going from hungry to not hungry. At the next moment, he sighed and said, If I eat Pigu Dan every day, I might go crazy. Lu Ming, who can be considered a foodie, couldn't have imagined that after Yi Bufan became a cultivator, he would not feel uncomfortable eating one Pigu Dan every three days. Anyway, he is very sad about this kind of life. Now he has no choice but to live this kind of life for now. After solving the problem of eating for three days, the next step is for each cultivator to take daily compulsory courses. Practice The fire attribute skill Yu Hua Ju has three levels, corresponding to the first, second, and third levels of qi refining. After practicing Yu Hua Ju to the level of the Yuan Man, one can enter the fourth level of qi refining. The cultivators of the five elements spirit root all have the same basic cultivation methods in the early stage of qi refining. The main spirit root cultivates the fire control technique with fire, the main spirit root cultivates the water control technique with water, and the main spirit root cultivates the earth control technique with soil. This basic five door and five element cultivation method is said to have been created and continuously improved by countless great powers during a very grand cultivator gathering, and finally emerged. These five cultivation methods not only enable people to quickly become cultivators, but also allow spiritual power to instantly adapt to countless cultivation methods in the middle of qi refining, eliminating the process of transformation. Therefore, the basic five element cultivation methods of the five gates gradually became a mandatory practice for spiritual root cultivators of the five elements. As for various mutated spiritual roots such as wind spirit root, thunder spirit root, ice spirit root, poison spirit root, there is no so dot called most basic cultivation method. Lu Mingpan sat on the bed, first of all, he needed to restore his spiritual power. Only when the spiritual power in the sea of qi reached saturation can he start practicing and increase his cultivation. Running Xiao Zhou Tian to restore spiritual power, the spiritual energy inside the inn is slightly higher than that inside the cultivator workshop outside the inn, and his speed of restoring spiritual power is also slightly faster. Time passes unnoticed. Lu Ming's spiritual power in the Sea of Qi reached 80 threads, and the Sea of Qi reached saturation. With a lot of spiritual energy, it recovers quickly. Lu Ming runs the first layer of the heart technique of Yu Hua Ju, and begins a continuous cycle of small Zhou Tian. The process of restoring spiritual power only requires following a small cycle and repeating the entire process to restore spiritual power. Cultivating and restoring spiritual power are different. Lu Ming now needs to run seven different small Zhou Tian cycles consecutively, and then a large Zhou Tian cycle to increase cultivation. When he can run nine different small weekly cycles continuously and finally successfully connect to the large weekly cycle, he will break through the first layer of gas refining and reach the second layer of gas refining. Just enter the first level of gas refining, you only need to complete one small cycle and another large cycle to improve your cultivation. Now he, who has 80 strands of spiritual energy in the sea of qi, needs a 7 plus 1 cycle of the big and small Zhou Tian to increase his spiritual power. This is one of the reasons why the cultivation speed is faster at the beginning and slower later on. End of this chapter Chapter 7 Zhang Chunmei You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 7 Zhang Chunmei Yi Family In a small room, a middle dot aged beauty dressed in yellow sat quietly on a wooden chair. She is the legitimate wife of the head of the Yi family, the malicious wife of Lu Ming, and Zhang Chunmei. After a while, the three person group chasing Lu Ming entered the small room and shouted in unison. Madam! Zhang Chunmei glanced at the three of them, picked up the spiritual tea next to her, took a sip, put down her tea cup, 
and asked lightly, Has anyone died? No, replied the elder brother from the third level of gas refining. Upon hearing these words, Zhang Chuanmei's expression changed slightly and she stared at the three of them for a while. No one has died, what are you doing back here? Do you want to accept my punishment? Madam, please listen to us first. There is a reason why we cannot kill Yi Bufan. If it weren't for this reason, Yi Bufan would undoubtedly die. Let's talk about it. Zhang Chunmei gestured to the elder brother of the third layer of qi refining to explain that if she couldn't hear the satisfactory reason for the failure, the consequences would be very serious. Madam, it's like this. After the three of us chased Yi Bufan to the cliff, he jumped straight off without a way. Madam, you must know the height of the cliff. Yi Bufan, a cultivator with a layer of qi refining, would have been seriously injured if he hadn't fallen to death. When the three of us chased after him, Yi Bufan had already run away. No matter how we chased after him, we couldn't catch up at all. It didn't look like a layer of qi refining cultivators jumping off a cliff. Therefore, I suspect that the master must have given him a life.saving pill to save his life. If there were no life.saving pills, we would definitely be able to kill Yi Bufan. We never expected that the head of the family would give the precious life.saving pills to Yi Bufan, so madam, we really can't blame us. So, he managed to escape and may be with the homeowner now. Obviously, Zhang Chunmei was not very satisfied with the explanation from the third layer of qi refining. Upon hearing this, the elder brother of the third layer of qi refining immediately denied Zhang Chunmei's idea and said, No, no. Madam, if Yi Bufan ran towards the head of the family, we would definitely keep chasing him, but he left the Yi family's sphere of influence and immediately hid before we returned empty-handed. At this point, the elder brother of the third layer of qi refining immediately quickened his pace and finished speaking the remaining words in one breath. Now we can confirm that Yi Bufan is fleeing in the direction of the Zhang family, and he should be within the influence range of the Lan family. After listening, Zhang Chunmei fell into contemplation. She didn't expect Yi Bufan to lose faith in his father and run away from the Yi family. This is a good thing for her. Based on this situation, it may not be long before Yi Bufan enters the influence range of her family's influence. Madam, if Yi Bufan runs away like this, he must not even know the distribution of the surrounding cultivation forces, otherwise he wouldn't have fled to the east. Yi Bufan knew at first glance that he had never seen the world, and perhaps he wouldn't have died within the influence of the Lan family without us taking action. You don't need to say this, I know it too. Zhang Chunmei glared at the third-level elder brother of Qi Refining. Yes, yes, madam, it was me who talked too much. You guys go down. Yes, madam. The three of them immediately left. If they killed Yi Bufan, they could still ask Zhang Chunmei for a reward. It's already good to not be punished without killing Yi Bufan. Not long after the trio chasing Lu Ming left, Zhang Chunmei left her seat and called for the person at the door to come in. Xiao Tsui. A woman in green entered, who was Zhang Chunmei's personal maid and came to the Yi family with her. Miss, do you have any instructions? Find an opportunity to solve the three people just now. Xiao Tsui was a bit puzzled. Just now, she heard clearly from outside that the reason for the failure of those three people's missions, given the young lady's personality, should not have killed them so decisively. Zhang Chunmei saw Xiao Tsui's confusion and explained, the three of them lied to me. I know the height of the cliff, and even if Yi Bufan jumps off and scathed, with their speed, as long as they chase after him with all their strength, they can definitely kill him before he leaves the influence of the Yi family. Miss, are you saying that when they were descending the cliff, they thought that Yi Bufan could never escape, so they descended very slowly, leading to the failure of the mission. Almost. Damn being so lazy about the task. Xiao Tsui left a sentence and left. The trio chasing Lu Ming was unaware because their concealment of some information led to their death. It seems that we need to go back to the Zhang family in a few days and make good arrangements. 
As long as Yi Bufan dies, the future head of the Yi family will definitely be her son, Zhang Chunmei. At that time, the Zhang family will have the opportunity to annex the Yi family and become a stronger cultivation family. Huangsha County In the Monks Inn Lu Mingpan sat on the bed practicing, and as the cycle of the great universe in his body ended, the eighty strands of spiritual power in the Sea of Qi finally added a trace and turned into eighty point one strands. After five hours of cultivation, his meridians felt a bloating and pain. The cultivation has reached its limit. Lu Ming stopped practicing, opened his eyes, and found a trace of spiritual power in the Sea of Qi. He was very satisfied with this achievement. A cultivator during the Qi refining period spends 12 hours a day, depending on their physical condition, talent, and cultivation techniques. Some cultivators during the Qi refining period cannot practice for 4 hours a day, while others can practice for 6 hours, or even 7 hours. Lu Ming's daily cultivation limit is around 15 minutes for 5 hours, making him one of the cultivators in the Qi refining period who has a longer cultivation time. The cultivation speed here is much faster than before. The richness of the spiritual energy of heaven and earth in the place where Yi Bufan lived from childhood to adulthood was only slightly higher than that in the small mountains where he fled and hid. If he had just become a cultivator, he would have been able to practice in places like inns. Now, at least in the early stage of the second level of gas refining, he can even enter the middle stage of the second level of gas refining. As the evening approached, Lu Ming lay directly in bed, looking at the ceiling. Having experienced his cultivation, he began to plan for the future. Lu Ming believes that the most important thing now, besides enhancing strength, is to understand the distribution of power in this area and then get a map. He purchased the seeds of inferior spiritual rice from the cultivator market in Huangsha County, and harvested inferior spiritual rice 18 days later. It is certain that he cannot sell it directly in this cultivator market. With a map, he can easily plan his movement route. Also, what are the specific rules of this world? I'm not sure either. The rules mentioned by Lu Ming can be said to be between people, between people and forces, or between forces and forces, the rules on the surface, as well as the hidden rules behind the scenes. He must understand all of these, otherwise it will be difficult for him to survive in this world. End of this chapter Chapter 8 Little Immortal Man You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 8 Little Immortal Man According to the cultivation technique, Yu Huiju, Lu Ming had his first step in judging this cultivation world. The breakthrough in cultivation involves both large and small bottlenecks. Breaking the bottleneck is closely related to one's own talent, the concentration of surrounding spiritual energy, and whether to use external objects for assistance. It is not mentioned that it is related to the mysterious and mysterious state of mind. By breaking through the bottleneck of the realm and having nothing to do with the state of mind, Lu Ming judged that in this world, there are generally no cultivators with immortal bone style, beyond the secular world, and without causal relationships. This indicates that the most fundamental law in this world is the law of the jungle. No cultivator cares about cause and effect or chance, cultivators only care about their own interests. Of course, these are just Lu Ming's preliminary judgments on this cultivation world based on the bottleneck of his cultivation techniques, and the world is always complex and diverse, and he can only ensure at most 40% accuracy of his own judgment. The malicious wife wants to kill me, probably for her son's sake, so that she can inherit the position of head of the Yi family. Killing me for her son. At least 50% of this world is similar to what I thought. Lu Ming thought of this information and had a greater confidence in the accuracy of his own judgment. There are three ways that Lu Ming can think of to better understand the world or simply understand the situation in this region. The first method is to learn through a large number of books. The second way is to learn through others. The third method is to personally experiment and understand. The third possibility is to be directly eliminated by Lu Ming, constantly learning from lessons and absorbing experience. This is not a rule of law society, and it is very likely to be fatal. 
The first method is very good, Lu Ming wants to choose but cannot. Because he is too poor. Every piece of knowledge and every piece of information in this world has a price, and it is still very expensive. He briefly previewed the shop for cultivating miscellaneous books and found that the lowest priced book requires a low dot quality spiritual stone, which is the monthly meal cost of an ordinary cultivator. So the second method is currently his best choice, and he has already chosen the target, which is the green clothed girl in the inn. Communication skills are my weakness, Lu Ming sighed helplessly, knowing that he was weak in this area. If the girl in green stood in front of him now, he wouldn't even know what to say in the first sentence. Have you ever had your meal? Are you really good dot looking? Is the weather nice today? Thinking about the scene in his heart, Lu Ming began to scratch his hair, feeling more and more embarrassed. Ha! Huh. Lu Ming took a deep breath. Forget it, I won't think about these things today. Let's talk about them tomorrow. As he spoke, Lu Ming fell asleep. From time travel to now, he has not slept yet, and over time, his body will be unable to bear it. With his current physical condition, he can stay up for five days without any sleep, and if he doesn't sleep after five days, it will seriously affect his cultivation. He is still in the qi refining period, and only by maintaining sufficient sleep every day can he have a better state of cultivation. When he opened his eyes again during this sleep, it was already the next morning. How comfortable! Lu Ming stretched lazily, and the cultivator's body was like a stick. He slept until dawn and woke up with a hundred times more energy, without any drowsiness. You should know that before crossing time, he had a habit of lying in bed every day. Every time he woke up, he had a feeling that I didn't get enough sleep, I was so tired, and I needed to sleep a little longer. This is the true cultivation of immortals. Just sleeping makes oneself particularly comfortable, Lu Ming thinks that becoming a cultivator is really good, eliminating impurities and preventing any illness from coming to him. What is the first thing you usually do when you wake up? You say. Go to the bathroom and pee. Yes. But this is something that ordinary people do. Cultivators don't do this kind of thing. A true fairy doesn't know how to defecate. At this moment, Lu Ming realized that he no longer needs to defecate or pee. I am now a fairy. Lu Ming was a bit overwhelmed with tears and laughter. To be honest, psychologically, he was still accustomed to doing these things, but physiologically, he was no longer allowed to do so. If he took off his pants now, people would think he had prostate problems. When absorbing memories, Lu Ming didn't pay much attention to Yi Bufan's daily behavior before and after becoming a cultivator. For example, now he realizes that he no longer needs to drink water, and even now, he has not felt thirsty. Coincidentally, I don't know how to drink or pee. That's not right. Lu Ming suddenly thought to himself, yesterday when he was farming, he sweated. Although he didn't sweat much, wouldn't the body of a cultivator actively absorb moisture from the air? The skin of an ordinary person loses moisture every day, maybe it's the opposite for a true cultivator. The human body itself is very magical, and Lu Ming thinks that the body of a cultivator is even more magical. Having curiosity is a good thing. Lu Ming knew that it was not the time to stimulate his curiosity and understand all of this. Anyway, the non-responsive nature of the mind to the body would disappear with the passage of time. Instead of spending time understanding these things, it's better to use it for cultivation in his farming career. It has been almost a day since the seeds of the inferior lingmi were planted, and the growth rate has accelerated five times. For the inferior lingmi, it has already been five days. He needs to enter the bead space now to check the situation. Lu Ming thought of this and immediately sat cross-legged on the bed, injecting a trace of spiritual power from the sea of qi into the white beads. Bead Space On an acre of spiritual field, seedlings of inferior spiritual rice have already grown, with each seedling about half an inch tall. Not bad, it's growing well. Lu Ming arrived at the first seedling of inferior lingmi, crouched down, 
and reached out to stroke the seedling. A slippery feeling reached his palm. This feeling is very good. Today, the focus of Lu Ming's observation is still on the 300th and 301st strains of inferior Lingmi, which share a common area. Lu Ming walked to the end of Ling Tian. The last two lower grade Lingmi plants were planted very close together, and they also grew seedlings, but the seedlings grew poorly and looked very unhealthy. The seedlings on their right and front are growing much better than them, but compared to other seedlings, they are still in a sub healthy state. Lu Ming's division of the spiritual field was just a plan, not a true division of the spiritual field. The two lower grade spiritual rice seedlings closest to him, due to the relationship between spiritual energy and nutrients in the stolen soil, have grown into this sub healthy state. This quasi spiritual field is no different from the quasi spiritual field outside. Lu Ming squatted down and carefully observed the condition of the four seedlings, and the conclusion was obvious. If the spiritual field in Juzi space is different from other spiritual fields, Lu Ming will definitely be overjoyed. Others plant 300 inferior spiritual rice plants per acre in their quasi-spiritual fields, while their quasi-spiritual fields produce at least 3,000 plants per acre. Unfortunately, the fact is different from what he thought. End of this chapter Chapter 9 Spells you are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 9 Spells 290.7 Lower Grade Lingmi Plants Are Growing Well, With Two Plants Growing Average and Two Plants In Poor Condition. One plant must be pulled out, otherwise if it continues like this, both inferior Lingmi plants will not survive until their maturity period. Lu Ming squatted down again. This time, he was comparing two seedlings of inferior Lingmi, and pulled out the one that looked worse. The consequence of not pulling out one plant is not only that two lower grade Lingmi plants have no harvest, but also that the other two lower grade Lingmi plants with average growth will be affected. Ten days after planting the inferior Lingmi, the first watering should begin. The spiritual field in the pearl space has been confirmed by Lu Ming to be just an ordinary spiritual field. If nothing unexpected happens, watering must be done. Regarding watering, it is roughly described in basic planting as follows. Within 10 days of planting low dot grade lingmi, it has not been soaked in water. After 10 days, it must be watered 5 or 2 times, as too much or too little can affect the yield the water used to water the rice can be ordinary water, but the water must be clear and have few impurities. If conditions permit, it is best to use the lowest level of lingquan water. The lowest level of Lingquan aquatic products are found in miniature Lingquan. Lu Ming plans to use ordinary water for irrigation. Lingquan is a rare item compared to Lingmai. In the local market of Huangsha County, he has not seen any shop specializing in selling Lingquan water. By the way, the second benefit of spatial spiritual fields is that there is no need to exterminate spiritual crops. In addition to accelerating the growth rate of spiritual crops, the second benefit that Lu Ming can think of in the pearl space is that there is no need for pest control. In the spiritual field outside, insects that can absorb spiritual energy during the growth process of spiritual crops will lay eggs on the spiritual crops, which requires prevention. Bead space can save this workload. The third benefit has also been found, there is no unpredictable weather. Lu Mingzi pondered for a moment, and although the spiritual field in Juzi space provides no difference in spiritual energy and nutrients compared to ordinary spiritual fields, it still has significant advantages in other aspects. Eliminating the need for caregiving, simply follow the planting method for inferior Lingmi according to the basic planting, allocate each small area reasonably, and irrigate it reasonably. The yield of inferior Lingmi per plant is 1 kilogram and there is 80% no problem. Before leaving Juzi space, Lu Ming specifically checked the information of Ling Tian. Name. Ling Tian grade. None area. One acre bonus. Five times growth rate on a simple transparent panel, the added items have characters. Returning to the in room, Lu Ming took out the low dot level spell, fireball technique and carefully read it. 
he plans to practice this low dot level spell. Lu Ming extended his right hand, spread his palm upwards, and after two breaths, a fireball one size smaller than a football appeared on his right hand. It takes two breaths to release the fireball, representing his low dot level spell fireball, which only reaches the entry dot level level. There are four levels of magic, namely beginner level, minor achievement, major achievement, and perfection. The fireball technique in the entry dot level realm requires two breaths to release the fireball. The small completion realm takes one breath, the large completion realm takes half a breath, and the final perfect realm can be activated instantly. In terms of power, there is no essential difference among the four realms. Now, in the realm of cultivation, I am the weakest vegetable chicken. Lu Ming dispersed the fireball in his right palm. The fireball technique in the entry dot level realm takes too long to rest. In Lu Ming's opinion, he only has the basic combat ability by cultivating the fireball technique to a great level. There is no secret to practicing spells, it's just about practicing time and time again to do the best in every detail, improve the speed of releasing spells, and ultimately achieve a perfect state of instant activation. After two more breaths, a fireball appeared again on Lu Ming's right hand. Practicing the fireball technique twice consumes his 16 strands of spiritual power. For him now, releasing each fireball requires 8 strands of spiritual power. He, who is full of energy and spiritual power, can only release a maximum of 10 fireballs. The amount of spiritual power consumed by spells is related to the state of the spell, the spiritual roots of the cultivator, and the quality of spiritual power. The higher the level of magic, the less spiritual power is consumed when releasing spells. The longer the length of the spiritual root, the less spiritual power is consumed. In the end, the better the quality of spiritual power, the less spiritual power is consumed. A little bit of cultivation time, recovery time is like a long night. Practice 10 times, consume 80 strands of spiritual power, and add a trace of energy consumed when entering the bead space. Lu Ming's aura is now empty. This is the norm for poor cultivators to practice spells. Lu Ming knew that he was relatively good, and those cultivators with short spiritual roots were more painful. Not only did they practice less, but they also took longer to recover their spiritual power. That's why cultivators with short spiritual roots have a slow speed in practicing spells. The environment of the inn requires Lu Ming an hour and a half to fill the sea of qi. If you use the lower grade spirit stone in the restoration tool spirit stone, it can be fully restored in half a quarter of an hour. Lu Ming took out an inferior spirit stone. He just took a look. I'm such a fool. Before, in the small mountain, I didn't know how to use inferior spirit stones to restore spiritual power. I foolishly absorbed the thin spiritual energy around me. Maybe it's my first time traveling and being chased, so I'm too nervous. Lu Ming comforted himself in his heart. Sometimes, when he looked back on what he had done, he realized how foolish it was. After calming himself down, Lu Ming began to regain his spiritual power. When his spiritual power was halfway restored, Lu Ming stopped restoring it. At this point in time, he planned to go find the girl in green. Wait a minute. Just as he was about to open the door with a token, Lu Ming stopped his movements. First, let me think about it carefully. What is the first sentence to say when we meet? It's not too late to go again. His first impression of the girl in green was really good. In this unfamiliar place, he even developed a slight liking for her. However, Lu Ming has not yet noticed the slightest bit of favoritism, because for him, farming and improving his own strength are the most important things now. Yes, that's it. Lu Ming plans to first praise the girl in green to win her favor, and then inquire about what he wants to know. It's all due to Yi Bufan's father. The things he gave Yi Bufan were too few, otherwise he wouldn't have needed them today. Besides necessary compliments, I must have a friendly smile on my face. So Lu Ming practiced wearing a smile for about twenty years. 
Everything is ready. Let's go. The first floor of the inn. The girl in green stood behind the counter, playing with her hair. Unlike yesterday, she wore a dress that turned white. Lu Ming walked up to the counter, with no extra expression on his face. Obviously, he had forgotten to wear a smile on his face, or it was really difficult for him to do it with people. Check out. Before Lu Ming could speak, the other person asked first. No, it's not. End of this chapter. Chapter 10 Relations Between Powers You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 10 Relations Between Powers Lu Ming's breathing speed began to increase, and his heart was constantly urging him. Praise her quickly, praise her quickly. Well, today. Lu Ming instinctively glanced down. Your clothes look really nice. Holy crap what am I talking about? I should praise her for her looks, not her clothes. Puzzy. Listening to his words and looking at his expression, she couldn't help but laugh out loud. I know, you want to know my name, right? My name is Huang Ying. Lu Ming listened to Huang Ying's laughter and for some reason, his mood suddenly relaxed. Then, he forgot many words praising Huang Ying in his heart, you're not entirely right, you're also quite right. My name is Lu Ming, tomorrow's Ming. Lu Ming also introduced himself. Yi Bufan's name is definitely not suitable, using his own name before crossing time is a good choice. I said Lu Ming, are you interested in me? The laughter stopped, and Huang Ying still had a smile on her face. Nothing. You're lying. I don't have it. Huang Ying's smile disappeared and she put on a, you're very boring, expression. The two remained silent for a while. Huang Ying stared at Lu Ming's green and handsome face and sneered, Sister, I'm not very interested in my little brother. I really don't have any interest in you, Lu Ming emphasized. He intended to speak well and win the favor of Huang Ying, but it was not the kind of favor between men and women. Before leaving, he had planned everything well, but things didn't go in the direction he was thinking in his mind. In his plan, after winning the favor of Huang Ying, he will then enter the Q&A session, where he will ask some basic questions that he does not understand, and Huang Ying will definitely answer these questions for him. I know. Huang Ying looked at Lu Ming's serious expression and her expression changed again. Finally, she burst out laughing. Lu Ming really doesn't understand why Huang Ying can inexplicably smile. He doesn't have any funny behavior. What are you laughing at? Lu Ming asked very straightforwardly. After Huang Ying stopped laughing, she answered Lu Ming's question, laugh at you for being cute. Cute. Lu Ming only remembered now that Yi Bufan was only 16 years old, which means he is still a 16-year-old boy now. In this world, ordinary people can live to the age of 80 or 90 as long as there are no accidents, and the life expectancy of cultivators during the qi refining period is at least 100. Men can only be considered adults here at the age of 20, while women are 18. Ling Zhen needs to be 10 years old to be tested. Yi Bufan spent five years successfully sensing qi, opening up the sea of qi, and becoming a cultivator. The important factor for successful gas sensing is not only the length of the spiritual root, but also the concentration of spiritual energy in the surrounding heaven and earth. If Yi Bufan had been able to cultivate at the inn where Lu Ming currently resides at the age of 10, it wouldn't have taken five years at all. In just two years, he would have been able to feel angry and succeed. Tell me what you're looking for, little brother. Huang Ying stopped smiling but there was still a playful smile on her face. It's really boring to be at the encounter every morning. Boring Huang Ying found it very interesting to play tricks on Lu Ming. Being called a little brother by someone, Lu Ming thought to himself, let's just call him a little brother. As long as he can ask him what he wants to know, being called a little brother doesn't matter. I want to ask you a few questions, Lu Ming tentatively spoke. So it's a question, okay, Huang Ying nodded and suddenly smiled. But before you ask me a question, you have to answer me one. You say. 
Huang Ying blinked at Lu Ming and asked, Little brother, do you think sister looks good on me? Upon hearing this, Lu Ming carefully examined Huang Ying's face. Her skin was very fair and delicate, and her features were more beautiful than ordinary people. Especially her eyes, Lu Ming particularly liked them. As the saying goes, one white mask a hundred ugliness, let alone Huang Ying, who is not at all ugly. Huang Ying is the most beautiful woman he has ever seen. After all, she is a cultivator, commonly known as a fairy, with no acquired impurities in her body, and her face looks comfortable. Good looking. Lu Ming said truthfully, you are the most beautiful woman I have ever seen. Really? Huang Ying couldn't conceal her joy on her face. Of course it's true, what did I deceive you into doing? I believe what you say, after all, you haven't seen many women, little brother. It's normal for you to think that I'm pretty, sister. Huang Ying has a clear understanding of her appearance. Among female cultivators, her appearance can only be considered at the middle level, but compared to ordinary women, she can indeed be considered a national beauty in heavenly fragrance. Huang Ying likes to be praised by others. If the other person can sincerely praise her, she likes it more. A handsome man sincerely praises her, and she likes it the most. Lu Ming's attitude and answers have made Huang Ying very satisfied. If you want to ask anything, just ask. As long as I know, I will definitely tell you, sister. Thank you very much. Lu Ming thanked first before asking a question, I came from the Yi family's territory. Huang Ying, which cultivator's territory does Huangsha County belong to? Lu Ming, did you come out of a mountain ditch? Huang Ying became serious and did not tease Lu Ming as her younger brother. However, the question asked by Lu Ming made her unable to resist asking him a question. As a cultivator, I don't even know this basic information. If other cultivators know about it, they should be made to laugh. Yes, after my master's death, I came out of the mountains. Only by understanding this information can I know what I will do in the future. Lu Ming answered half truthfully. I see. Huang Ying can be 100% certain now that Lu Ming, this little brother, really hasn't seen many women. Although Lu Ming has not seen many women, it does not prevent him from praising her for her beauty, and she is happy in her heart. Huangsha County is under the influence of the third-rate Xiuzhen aristocratic family, the Lan family. Generally speaking, both the Xiuzhen aristocratic family, the Lan family, and the Yi family, are dependent on the second-rate sect, the Tsanghai sect. This large area is the territory of the Tsanghai sect. On a smaller scale, Huangsha County is the territory of my Huang family. Although my family is still an unremarkable cultivator, they also manage Huangsha County and the smaller forces around them Lu Ming nodded. Originally, the Yi family was a third-rate cultivation family. Based on the information provided by Huang Ying, he can accurately determine that the forces formed by the cultivators in the cultivation world belong to a small force backed by a larger force, and the larger force backed by a stronger force. Various attachment relationships can reduce friction and reduce war. Of course, this may only be the cultivation world, where the relationships between regional powers may differ in other regions. Huang Ying, do you know how big this world is? This question is a bit difficult for me, Huang Ying shook her head, knowing that the world was very big. End of this chapter